Hello everyone and welcome back to Cooking, Comics and Connor with your host Connor. Like every episode I take the theme from the previous How to Read video and I pick an aspect and cook a dish based on it. Uh, this week's theme is everyone's favourite sitcom star Wanda Maximoff also known as Scarlet Witch. Hi again, here for another reminder. I am not a master chef. I'm still learning. Uh, if you want to actually follow a decent tutorial, I'd highly recommend Googling or YouTubing it. Now, before we get into any planning, I'd highly recommend watching the previous How to Read episode so you're up to date on your Scarlet Witch knowledge. After a little bit of thought, I was really inspired to create a dish I hadn't made before. Um, I really wanted to choose something from Eastern Europe as uh, Wanda comes from a fictional country, uh, Sokovia, but we know Sokovia is located in Eastern Europe. After lots of consideration and running through other possibilities, I settled on making a Wiener Schnitzel and a Croatian cheese Stuckli, if I'm pronouncing that correctly. First on my list of things to make was the cheese Stuckli. Unfortunately though, it wasn't a big success. I think I messed up when making the dough. The final product, instead of being cheesy, it was instead doughy and bland. But when you cook, sometimes you make mistakes. And this was my first attempt at making the dish. Um, so it wasn't, it wasn't a guaranteed success. I'll definitely try to this dish at a later point. And if you want to see any updates on my skills or any reattempts, at making a dish, I'd highly recommend uh, checking out the Instagram link below. This is where we update everything to do with the channel and everything to do with live streams. Now I have to say, the highlight of my cooking attempts was definitely the Wiener Schnitzel. Uh, I think this dish came out really well, so I'm going to run through what I did step by step. First off, I prepared my pork chops. I trimmed off any excess fat and any excess bones. Traditionally, a Wiener Schnitzel is made with veal cutlets, but I used pork as it was easy and convenient for me to get. Next, I blended up my bread for breadcrumbs, I seasoned up my flour, and I whisked up my eggs, ready so I can panne up my pork. Uh, I also made sure to put my oil on the heat. Once my oil was hot enough, I began frying the pork chops. I fr fried each side uh, for a couple of minutes until it was nice and golden brown, and the Wiener Schnitzel was done. Simple as that. Now, two very different results for my final products. One dish failed, and one came out really tasty and easy to make. All in all, I'd consider this a successful dive into Eastern European cuisine, uh, and I will definitely be attempting to make these dishes again in the future. Not every dish can be perfect, and most won't come out well on the first attempt. Uh, but that's why you have to keep trying until you get it right. Thank you to anyone who watched it to the end of this video. Please leave any constructive criticism or any other thoughts in the comments below. Uh... In the, please check out the links in the description. Uh, I'm going to put the recipes that I used um, and the link to the How to Read episode. Uh, see you in two weeks.